So to me, this issue is not only about climate change, it is about real basic economics and job growth. Um, but we are at a, I mean, talk about getting back to the, one of the early questions about consensus. I mean, we, we have lost, and this troubles me deeply about the course direction of our politics, we've lost a consensus that we are going to believe in science. <laughs> you know, if you think about Dwight Eisenhower as President of the United States through the 1950s, coming out of World War II, there, this is the era that when I was in grade school, there wasn't a person in the world that would not have believed in the basic, uh, the basic scientific method and the basic kind of consensus of science, Democrats or Republicans. I thought about this since. I mean, Eisenhower had won a world war based on science. He had, you know, I mean, that whole war machine, for better or worse, from the, you know, the atom bomb to the weather, meteorological decisions on when to land on the shores of, uh, 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 of Normandy to all of it. If, if we had been calling that based on religious principles, we probably wouldn't have won. So now, uh, and it's true of everything, the medical science. I mean, people who, are, who are, seem so opposed to this kind of idea that science should at least be the basis that we can all kind of work from, they go into great medical facilities and get treated as a result of these huge, you know, scientific things. And yet we do not have a consensus today on whether or not we accept science.